we cooked this turkey at um, 12 pounds of pressure for an hour and a half, and it looks like it's falling off the bones. And he's just going to take it over here so that we can take it out of the pot, and then we'll debone it, remove all of the unwanted parts, and get it ready for the soup. Okay, and we've got the bird out of the pot, and it's ready in this pan for deboning and cutting it up. And Hugh will pour the rest of the broth and meat into the colander in the soup pot. And as you can see, we've got jars washed here and ready for canning. Okay, and we've got the bird out of the pot, and it's ready in this pan for deboning and cutting it up. And Hugh will pour the rest of the broth and meat into the colander in the soup pot. And as you can see, we've got jars washed here and ready for canning. Well, while the turkey is cooling, I'm getting ready to um, put the vegetables in the pot of soup. And I've got this nifty little chopper device. So I've put half of an onion in here, and I'll show you what that looks like. this over and drop it in the, just a slicing tool. Very got a very sharp edge on it and little serrated edges here. So I use it to cut the carrots and you just have to be really careful when you get down to the end not to cut yourself. So I'm gonna cut about eight of these carrots to go in the pot of soup, and you can see the small chunks that they come in. I'm using the same little slicer to cut up um, a whole stalk of celery, and you can see that down there, and I just added a one pound package of pearl barley to the broth. Okay, I'm just adding four cans of organic diced tomatoes to the pot. And if you have fresh tomatoes, that's even better, but we're working with what we've got here. Another favorite seasoning is Worcestershire sauce, so go ahead and pour a bit of that in there. We also like Bragg's liquid aminos, so that works just as well. And I've got four cans of kidney beans that I just rinsed that I'm adding to the soup. We call this Mayhew Minestrone. Okay, the soup has been cooking for about 45 minutes, and the barley is well, pretty well done. I'm going to go ahead and add a couple of packages of frozen green beans. Of course, if you have fresh green beans, that's always better. But Again, we're working with what we have, and I'm going to go ahead and add um, maybe a couple of cups of corn to this also. So just to give you a, a look at the soup, we've got the tomatoes, the turkey, barley, green beans, corn, and we'll let that go ahead and cook for another 10 minutes or so, and I've got the jars in this other pot. They are, um, they've been sterilized, so they're ready to go. And the next step will be to put the soup in the jars and get them ready for processing.